This is Gary Yangberg. I'm out on Madison's Lake Caganso with DNR technician Scott Harpold. Scott, tell me what we're doing today. Uh, we're doing our comprehensive lake survey for Lake Caganza. Uh, we have our lakes are on a five-year rotation, and this is the year for this lake. So we're out here uh, with pike nets, getting uh, a hold on what kind of fish populations we have, seeing if uh, we're running high, running low, or right where we're supposed to be. And you've been running the nets now for the past week? Yep, for about a week and a half here on Kiganza, and before that, uh, Lower Mud Lake, which is considered part of this lake. Uh, we were on there for about three weeks getting northern pike estimates. Take it in the nets here on another net we're checking. Bringing in more nets here. Higher, higher up. There you go. Ooh, great. Wow. <laughs> really big one. Harp <laughs> or a buffalo? Well, I guess I don't know. I can't see the head. We'll get rid of some of the little riffraff here. Measuring some fish here that were just taken out of the fike nets. LO2. 24 inches, female, so, they're clipping the tail, so identification purposes, back in the water. Female, 29.8. Clipping the tail again. Back in the water. Animal abuse. Twenty five point six male. Like I said, they're fail fin clipping for identification purposes and to make sure they don't get the fish again. Long nose gar. Got a dick? Yeah, it look like a trainer. Well, come on. Earn your keep. 